All right, Shalom. First and foremost, call Elohim La, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Ha'arachat Badash. Double honors to our apostles at Great Millstone, who are where to touch the truth. Peace, love, blessings, and salutations to you, Akim Salakim. That are part of the Bayat Shah Double Dot House of David. So basically, I'm just uh, bringing up the topic that every brother's been on through the spirit. Uh, online Harms Act. Better, better known as uh, C-63. All right. Um, through the spirit, just wanted to hit a couple points on it. I was watching the brother's video on it and also watching the commentary on it and... Um, you know, that's a real um, heavy draconian measure brought out just for the, the times, you know, which really we read that um, in the book of Isaiah that Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, he formed the light and the darkness, you know, right? He creates, uh, roughly paraphrasing, he creates the good and he creates the evil. So, as we uh, get closer to these times of uh, the famine of the word coming, because I mean, honestly, yeah, videos, they said videos from 10 years ago, they could uh, get you on or whatever. And some, some brothers got multiple pages. And some brothers of the spirit still, you know, hey, well, us real brothers still going out on the highways. All right. And, um, you know, just Amos 8 and 11. Okay, and this is a, a basically a time, you know, especially for, you know, y'all that watch us, all right, to, to, to get it while you can, get it while it's hot, like the apostles been saying. All right, this truth, this truth should be, be on you, I mean, in you, so like it. And on you, of course, you know, we got the Holy Scripts, but this truth should be uh, in you, all right? And um, another thing, they they said that, you know, it's a, it's a harsh bill, which, hey, man, whatever. Because the main ones that they aim that towards are the Israelites. And it's funny that this, this happens after uh, Mr. Burns uh, passes. You know, that's the funny, that's the funny thing, but it's all moving toward and gearing toward prophecy of us brothers getting out of here and Yahweh Shai coming back because regardless of the fact that what anybody says, the famine of the word must happen, all right? And hey, that's the Lord removing his mercy, okay, from from Israel. Remember the scriptures say um, that teacher shall not be removed from a corner anymore. And we, hey, starting with the apostles, you know, yeah. uh, 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 the ones that we learn from, you know, they've been on the street corners for how long? You know? They've been on the street corners for how long? So, through the Spirit, starting with them, I mean, they haven't been removed from a corner anymore. And it says, uh, that's Isaiah 30 and 20, but thy eyes shall see thy teachers. Well, now we're coming into the time uh, um, that the Lord's mouthpieces are going to be removed off the street corners. All right? Because the Lord been given warning. Okay? Just like he told Ezekiel. All right? The Lord been given warning. And you Israelites, which is not meant for you to get it, all right? You have you have been warned. <laughs> you have been warned. That's what I'm gonna name this. You have been warned. Okay. We got the blood off our hands, so to speak. All right. Brothers been out week in and week out. Whether it's been one brother, two, three brother. Okay? 
and it's in can the bill is in Canada, but of course America is going to up upscale and updo that because Canada is a part of uh, NATO. All right. So what you think is going to happen here? All right. And they deem it hate. They deem it hate speech. Okay, but really it's not hate speech. First and foremost, we teach the gospel. All right, we teach the gospel, which gospel means good news. We, we teach the gospel. The scriptures say the gospel of peace, and that's what we teach. All right, but see, the reason why it's hate speech is because our us us and the heavenly well, the heavenly Father and His Son. <clears throat> all right. Are totally against uh, the American society. Okay, they're totally against this world right now in a whole because the world is filled with darkness and wickedness. So everything that we speak, that we bring out of the scriptures, is righteousness and is contrary to what this place stands for. It's contrary to what these elites stand for. Okay. Remember Revelation, the eleventh chapter. They stood upon their feet and great fear fell upon them that seen them or saw them. All right, that's still in effect. And we're still out here. Why? Because they can't touch us. Okay? But the Lord is getting ready to make a, 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 a move. He's getting ready, he's getting ready to make a move to where when they when they put their hands on us, he's gonna be able to. Because prophecy is coming to pass, he's going to be able to make a move, man. Okay? So that's that's what you see. That's what you see going on. All right? The Lord getting ready to make a move. Do my prophets no harm. Okay? The Lord's getting ready to make a move, man. And call out Yahweh Hashem shine. You know? Another thing too is with that um with that um that bill being passed, a lot of you uh Israelites, Israelite groups that are into this gun gun thing. Alright, and it's and it's the spirit because the brothers was talking about it at camp, like yo, you got you got a uh, 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 people afraid to come up to the camps because uh, uh, these dudes got uh, um, the the firearms on them. Especially like yo, that's the Kari man. That's the Kari Arizona camp man. Uh, yo man, they they take the cake on that, you know. But um, we're gonna see what Israelite groups are talking about this. You know what 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 groups are talking about this draconian measure? Because honestly, to be real, man, a lot of these uh, other groups man fall into that category you know, they they you know the scriptures say uh if possible be at peace with all men so you know, a lot of these israelite groups fall into that category of um uh, the harmful um, the harmful act that's okay though because at the end you know at the end of the day through the spirit um you know, the ones that have been in it, you know, like the scriptures say, you know, uh, uh, you know, the ministry, let's the ministry be blamed. All right. You're supposed to be bl uh, blameless in a ministry. So, you know, this is, this is a good thing. The, the, the Lord is weeding in, he's weeding out. All right. He's weeding out the ones he don't want, because when this, when this thing goes down, we're going to see how many uh, brothers and Lord willing, you know, I pray you know that I don't fold. I pray that you brothers out there don't fold, you know. What's going to happen? You know, uh, is this going to be the time, you know, are you willing to lose, you know, your life for Yahweh Hashem sake? And I'm saying in a, in a sense of like, oh, I might go to prison for this. I might, you know, that, you know, are you willing to let go of your, your kids and your so-called wife? on this side you know just just for the truth's sake are you willing to do this and that's what it's boiling down to okay we see it we definitely see it it's here ain't no more ain't no more guessing ain't no more you know wondering 
and ain't, ain't no more of that, man. You know, this thing is this thing is here, man. And everything the brothers, the pro the prophets of the Lord, the brothers been speaking on, that's that's what's going on. All right. Salakia. Water store open. Oh, you know what? This is so called Chinese New Year. But I ain't gonna spend too much more time on this, man. I just wanted to bring out some points through the spirit. So um, keep your eyes peeled, and um, let's 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 watch prophecy unfold and come to pass as it's been doing. It's like uh, Apostle Tar deemed it, and Passover is coming up in a couple weeks. The the hopeful year of Jacob's trouble, and Lord willing, we here, man. 